What's up, my beloved? Y'all, this is your girl, Tracy Philippa, the author of From Adultery to Ministry, and I am here with another tip about abstinence. <laughs> another tip that was going to get you through your abstinence journey. Um, as a believer, trust me, I know it's difficult, but we are going to get through this together. You know, you're not doing this alone. And uh, one of the tips to keep your abstinence is to have accountability partners. Y'all, I know I'm grown. I'm a grown woman. I'm 33 years old. I'm in my Jesus year. However, I know that sometimes, you know, I may not be able to trust my own judgment. Especially if that temptation, you know, is six foot one tall, dark, handsome, and bearded. But anyway, <laughs> I digress. <laughs> but one of the things we have to know is that sometimes we can't trust ourselves. And so we always put people in position that are able to hold us accountable. If you're going to go with the opposite sex, make sure there's at least one or two people that know where you are, that know your curfew, and who's going to check up on you to make sure that you keep your abstinence. Okay? So have accountability partners. It doesn't mean that you're weak, but it means that you're making sure that you fortify um, your purity. So I love you. God bless you. Bye.